Hey, dang. Why can't I see anything? Am I blind? No, Jeff, you're not blind. I put a blindfold on you because I got you a birthday surprise. Birthday surprise? Yeah, a birthday surprise. All right, Jeff, I'm going to open your eyes. Happy birthday! Holy horse testicles, dang! You got me a bounty house? Yep, Jeffy, I got you a bounce house. Are you kidding me, Daddy? No, no, go jump in it, Jeffy, go jump in it. Yeah! Oh, Mario, he's so happy. Yeah, I knew he'd love it. It just took forever to get this thing inside the house. Where'd you get it from? I got it from Toys R Us. Oh, well, you know what else is today, Mario? What? The solar eclipse. What, a solar eclipse? Yeah, it's when the moon blocks out the sun. Oh, oh, Jeff, oh Jeffy, oh no. Oh, Jeffy, Jeffy. Daddy, why is the house pop? I don't know, Jeffy. I guess it's just cheap. But, but don't worry, I got you another surprise. Oh, no, surprise? Yeah, come on, Jeffy, follow me. All right, Jeffy, it's time for your second surprise. Hang on, Daddy. Why can't I see anything again? And why am I holding a bat? Because, Jeffy, you're going to hit a pinata with that bat. What's your pinata? Uh, it's a, it's a horsey full of candy. A horsey full of candy? I always see a horsey full of candy. Well, you can't see it, Jeffy. You have to have your blindfold on. Why? Because you're supposed to hit the horse with your bat. Why are you doing because you're supposed to beat the horse until all the candy comes out. <laughs> okay, dang. But how am I going to hit the horse if I can't see it? Well, that's the part of the game. You're not supposed to see it. You're supposed to just run up there and just swing your bat and hope you hit it. And I won't get in trouble? Nope, you won't get in trouble. Just swing at it. Well, all right, dang. Stop it! Stop that, Jimmy! Did I get the horsey guy? No, you, you messed it completely, Jimmy! <sighs> Oh my god, he just put a huge hole in the wall. Mario, you can't get mad at him. He just did what you told him to do. Oh, I know, I know. Just just, just take him into the kitchen. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask Jeffy how his birthday cake's doing. Just give, give me that back. Come on, Jeffy. <sighs> After so many hours, this cake is finally done. Hey, Chef Beaver, are you done with Jeffy's birthday cake yet? Yeah, Mario is right here. Oh, wow, that looks just like a Cheerio box. Thank you, but one question. Why did you have me make a Cheerio box cake? Well, because Jeffy really likes Cheerios, so he wanted a Cheerio cake. Oh, well, get your stupid cake. I gotta clean up the kitchen. All right, thank you so much, Chef Pee. Mm -hmm. oh, he's gonna love this. <clears throat> All right, Jeffy, here's your birthday cake. <gasps> my birthday cake is Cheerio box, Daddy? Yeah, it's a Cheerio box. Can I stick my peepee -pee in it? Uh, no, Jeffy, it's a birthday cake. Here, stick your peepee -pee in it. Oh, wait, wait, where's Rosalina? I don't even know. Oh, hold on, Jeffy, I'll be right back. She has, she has to be here for this. What, baby, what are you doing? The solar eclipse is about to happen, Mario. Well, Jeffy needs to blow out his birthday candles. Oh, well, let's hurry. I don't want to miss this. Okay, we'll hurry, we'll hurry. Oh. All right, let's sing happy birthday to Jeffy. Oh, oh, oh. Jeffy! Oh, oh, Jeffy! Jeffy, stop it! <laughs> Jeffy, what are you doing? I was giving the Cheerio box my pee-pee. Well, Jeffy, now we can't eat cake because your pee-pee was in it. Hurry and make a wish, Jeffy. The solar eclipse is happening right now. A wish? What do I wish for? Well, Jeffy, it's your birthday. You can wish for whatever you want. So blow out the candles and wish for whatever you want. Whatever I want? Hmm. <gasps> the solar eclipse is happening right now! Jeffy, hurry and make a wish! Uh, uh, I wish today would last forever. <laughs> Yay, Jeffy, you made your wish! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! You want a piece of your cake, Jeffy? J Jeffy? What? Jeffy! Come on, Mario, let's go outside and watch the solar eclipse before it's over! Uh, 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 come on, Jeffy, I'll yell at you later. <sighs> Whoa. Whoa! It's a total solar eclipse, Mario! It looks so amazing! It looks like a butthole, Daddy. Well, well, how long does it usually last? About a minute. Oh, so let's enjoy this minute. Uh, I thought you said this only lasts a minute. It does, but it's been like 10 minutes. What's going on? Um, Daddy, what would happen if that butthole started pooping? That'd be some big poops. Um, I think we should go turn on the news and find out what's going on. Breaking news, you guy! The solar eclipse! Just won't stop. NASA's holding an emergency press conference. Let's go to that. Uh, hello there. I am Space Cadet Brooklyn T. Guy. I'm with NASA. Uh, we called this emergency press conference here today because the solar eclipse that was supposed to happen today is still going on. Uh, it was only supposed to last a minute. It, uh, it, it has now lasted 15 minutes, and the moon has not moved. So we're a little scared. But uh, we're, we're gonna wait for another five minutes before we before we really start freaking out. Oh no, Mario! The moon isn't moving. Wait, why is it doing that? What's happening? Are we gonna die? We're gonna no, die! No, no, calm down. Everything will probably be okay. We should just wait the five minutes, like the astronaut said. Oh, oh, okay, we'll just we'll just wait the five minutes, I guess. Dang, did the butthole in the sky do something bad? Oh, we we don't know yet, Jeffy. Bad butthole, bad! You better stop what you're doing right now before I come up there and lick it. 
Yeah, yeah, so so the moon has still not moved. It's it's still blocking the sun. Uh, it, it would be really nice if the moon would, would please move. Please, please move. Uh, sunlight is crucial for uh, humans and plant life on Earth. And uh, without sunlight, we could all die. But uh, we, we are working on a solution to this problem to try to fix this situation, but uh, we could all die. Ah! We're gonna die! We're gonna die! Mario, Mario, <laughs> stop freaking out! You're gonna scare Jeffy on his birthday! He doesn't even understand what's going on. Look at you, Mr. Butthole. You're scaring my daddy. So you better stop him right now. Hey, Daddy, um, how do you wipe your butt if you're scared of buttholes? I'm not scared of buttholes, Jeffy. Okay, <laughs> so we got some good news. Uh, no, before you ask, the, the moon has not moved out of the way of the sun, but we do have some solutions on how we can move the moon out of the way of the sun. Okay, so first we're gonna try scaring the moon so it runs away. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm gonna sneak up and scare the moon. Boom! Did, did it work? Are you scared? Well, that didn't work. That is one fearless moon. But don't panic, we got more ideas. Uh, next, we're gonna try to wrap a bunch of rope around the moon and tow it away. Uh, I, I'm gonna need a lot more rope than this, about 35 million feet of rope. But I, I think I know a guy, just, I'll be right back. Okay, so I got the rope tied around the moon. Uh, luckily, I had a friend that owns a rope store and just had stockpiles of rope sitting around. So yeah, let's move this moon. Oh, come on, you bastard moon! All right, let me kick it into maximum overdrive. Ah, damn it, the rope broke. That's it, the moon is really starting to piss me off. All right, so we have no other choice. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to nuke the moon. But I mean, I mean, come on, what has the moon ever done for us, right?